Hello everyone and welcome back. Meat Department here. I'm so glad you could join me for another video today. So we are in our third journey on this Noob to Pro series for Anime Fighting Simulator. I have been grinding and grinding and really just learning the game and it is getting a lot of fun. So today we're going to focus on sword styles. There's water style, thunder style, wind style, and of course the most rare, flame style at 3.63% drop chance. So I blow through quite a bit of Chikara today. I open up a total of 37 of these bad boys. We're gonna fast forward through a lot of this. You don't have to sit through and be bored and only get to the fun parts. But I opened 37 today to get these, which is actually a 2.7% drop rate for me. So it took me even longer than what is posted um, to get the flame style, but I did. And then we have some fun doing a little bit of world PVP ganking getting owned ourselves a little bit and then we jump in see what it's like on nine tails the boss and uh finally we'll recap and show you some of the stats and moving forward what the next thoughts are on this character to progress it because this is a noob to pro journey you are with me from the very start to hopefully those leaderboards in the future so without further ado let's go ahead and get started Try to unlock these sword styles so here we are at the vendor and we got thunder style to start we'll go over and check out the specials you see i have 53k chikara right now which means i had 55k to start so i'm gonna blow through this we'll fast forward here so we don't have to stick around and open up every single one very slow but you will get a good idea of what keeps dropping a lot of waters thunders winds just really everything all around so i ran out of debt gems that fast i had to go and farm more uh, of the shards. Here I am after this dimension. Like, ah, let's spend the 2k I got. Nope, no luck. Water style. Ah, so there's another 2k. So we already just opened up 28 at this point. So that's 56,000 Chikara shards spent. Nothing. So here I am. I'm going through each dimension. Two, dimension three, running some routes, and then we get into dimension four, running the route to collect the Chikara. Because, you know, we want to have enough so we can do a nice little spree. We'll eventually go back to Dimension 2 when we do get enough shards and talk to the little sword style vendor here. Maybe he'll have better luck than Dimension 1. So not, not yet. As you see, we're opening up a whole bunch. Nothing. Nothing, nothing. It does ultimately take 9 of these, I believe, in this dimension before it finally drops. Um, so it should be... Oh, is this it? Ah, this is it. Yes, the flame style finally dropped. I'm all excited. Super excited. Let's run around. Let's run around in, in pure happiness. Run around like a crazy man in a circle. Oh, yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> jump up. Jump up and down. Jump up and down. Spin around. Wait a minute. Let's take a look at this. The flame style, unknowing fire. Charges toward your opponent at high speed using one or multiple slashes. And there's the blooming flame undulation spins in a circular motion creating a ring of flames that's the cool one and then there's rengoku a devastating dashing slash engulfing player in flames that is very strong based on your sword skill so let's equip that little flame cloak looking thing and bam there's the very first ability you see it's a it's a little burst we'll do it again just to see bam there it is there's a little flame a little dash character charges forward but i want to see the big boy here it is the big boy that thing is, is really cool. I love that one. Uh, you want to get your chakra up to make that one more powerful. And then we got the last one here based on your actual sword. Boom, look at that. That's like another charge, like Phoenix. Just charging forward. It's so cool. I really love this. And this, this deserves being the most rare and strongest one because it has really cool abilities on this one. I'm so happy to have this. Oh, yeah, let's do it again. So I think with this, there's only one thing left to do. We should probably go see if we can gank. It starts a world PvP. Oh, the little chest here. Gotta get that, of course. <laughs> and then use the ability again. Oh, it's so cool looking on, on the screen. So yeah, let's hop to Dimension 1 and see what we can find. Alright, let's sit outside here and... Oh, what's... This guy's looking... <laughs> Swing! He ran right into me. Um, I bet you he wasn't expecting that. What do we got here? Oh no, what's this? Don't jump away from me. Boom! Take that flame sword skill. Take it. Take it, son. Take it home. No me. <laughs> what do we got down here? A little fishing party? 
Oh, I don't think so. Trifecta! Get it! <laughs> he oosted. Oi. He oosted, he soared. Hey! Uh-oh. Uh oh, unsuspecting victim, Zink. 200. Ah. Uh, oh no, this this guy can't get shards. You collect them way too fast, my friend. Way too- Oh no, it's Zink! Zink, he wants to fight! Beat up! Fight me! Challenge accepted! Okay, come to rock. Alright, let's go! Okay, the rock. Alright, let's land. Oh, there he is, he's hiding. What's what's he up to? What's, what's Zink? You win? Oh, I don't think so, Zink. Get wrecked! <laughs> Get wrecked, Zink. You're, you're so owned. Uh, oh, flying. Who's- who, wait, who's- who's this? Oh no, what a cheater kid. <laughs> who are you? QM Lock, you just killed Zink and I. We didn't even get to duel. Uh, oh well. Alright, what are we- wait, what, what the heck? <laughs> Foosh! On fire. On fire. Oh my goodness. Back in Dimension 1, what's this? Oh, I missed. I missed. Alright. Oh, his friend's coming out. Oh, oh, come back here. Ah, safe zone. Guys, come on with the safe zone. Really? Stand outside the let's Oh, you want to go? Boom. Phoenix. Yep. Get wrecked. What the heck? We got someone back on the rock here? Yes, we do. Let's get him. Boom. Boom. Yep. Get it. And let's jump into Nine Tails. Do a little fast forward here so you don't have to watch the entire battle. But I wanted to come in and actually use the sword skill at the boss. And wow, it's actually really good. Total damage, 1.5k. This was the most damage I've done yet. Just absolutely destroyed the boss doing all that damage. So that was a lot of fun, man. Using that flame sword, doing some bosses, doing the old-fashioned world. Ganking PvP. Good times, good times. So let's just have a little update on where the character stands now on this episode of the progression from noob to pro. Already at 519.3 quadrillion overall power level. I am so happy that we got the uh, flame power right here for the sword skill. Um, no, not for the sword skill, what am I doing? <laughs> for the sword style, we got the flame style. This thing is pretty sweet. So I believe um, the Z unknowing fire uh, uses strength modifier. X, the Blooming Flame uses Chakra, and C, the Rengoku, is what actually uses the sword skill. So we really want to boost up and get the next sword skill from Zoro, Excalibur. And I've, I've been working on this one. It has taken a long time to get that 1,000 quadrillion. But hey, that's going to boost up the flame even more so. So we have finished all of the quests from Master Roshi, from Bang, of course. Um... And we are on Zoro's sword skill. Um, so yeah, it's looking pretty good. The stats, how we're looking. We are at 6.3 quadrillion strength, 58.6 quadrillion durability, 4.7 quadrillion chakra. The sword, 449 quads. Huh? Agility, just 372. I don't even know what agility is really useful for. And speed, 8.5 billion. So that's what we're looking like here. The total power bringing us to that 519, and I am loving it. So the durability is a lot higher than the rest because I just sit on the durability while I swing the sword because this quest is taking forever <laughs> to finish. But man, have I gotten so strong in just a short amount of time uh, playing this, and I got a lot more growth ahead of me on this character, but it's just great to see the progression, start to get more familiar with the game and how things work. Um, so we do have the best, I keep clicking that, the specials. You know, the flame style, I'm not sure what I'll go for next. Maybe I'll go for the best quirk. Quirks are, are really fun. So maybe we'll go for the quirks next and get the best quirk. And then try that out and go for a little spin around the world. See who we can gank. Uh, <laughs> it's a lot of fun. On that, as far as powers go, after beating the boss, uh, after getting this flame, I did get a new skill I got. Multiple bomb, rest and shuriken, and man, this thing. I was wondering what it was everyone was using when I saw the colors, and <laughs> now I know. 
That is so cool. I'm so glad I got that off of Nine Tails there. Um, so a lot of fun. Doing Nine Tails actually seems like it's pretty soloable now. You know, just stay my distance, do the shuriken, throw a little spirit bomb in there. By the time I drop, I can do a little uh, sword stuff, run away just for a second, get back up in the air just enough to let another round rip. You know, rinse and repeat. By that time, Nine Tails is here, and I bam, flame phoenix right through it, and rinse and repeat, and he definitely drops. So I'll be farming the uh, abilities from him for sure on solo. Um, but yeah. So that's it. This has been a lot of fun. I hope you enjoy this Noob to Pro series. And this is straight up Noob to Pro because I've never played this game before until I started uh, uploading the video. So I'm learning it as I go along, trying to understand the game and hopefully become a power player in just a matter of time. Um, so yeah, that's it. I want to thank you for joining me. Oh, I'll give a little shout out here actually to Roxam XWGTS. Shout out to you, brother. He has been watching the channel for a while. Loves the anime fighting simulator videos. <laughs> so great. Nice to see him here. Shout out to you, brother. Um, but yeah, so if you liked the content, uh, if you want to see me grind something particular, leave it in the comments below. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, smash that bell for notifications so you become aware when I do release new videos. Um, but until next time, have a great day, keep grinding, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.